Hello YouTube and Preppers, this is the Comms Prepper, and in this video I'm going to demonstrate some of the many features of ICOM's newest radio, the IC7300. Tonight I'm going to check into an HF radio network called the American Preparedness Radio Network, or the Tapper Net for short, and I'll put a link down below. And I'll demonstrate some of the things I have to do to get this radio up and running and operational to check into that net. And I'll record the preamble for that net for this video, and then we'll wrap the video up. This is a really cool radio. It's got a lot of features. I've added a new playlist here in the channel. So as I read the manual and learn about the radio, I'll keep adding videos. But I figured we'll do a kind of getting the radio out of the box and check it into a net video here. And no better place to start off being a prepper channel than checking into the American Preparedness Radio Network. So let me get set up here. I'll walk you through the process of getting this radio turned on, getting the antenna tuned, and then finding your net. Okay, so we'll start by hitting the power button, turning the radio on. You have a nice color LCD screen here. Right now we're set to the 80 meter band and the tapper net's actually on the 40 meter band so we'll demonstrate how this screen works. I'll just tap the three and all the HF radio bands come up so you can jump right to them. We're gonna go ahead and hit seven for seven megahertz or the 40 meter band and here you can see a waterfall display. What I'm gonna do is zoom in on that with the camera and I may have to do some creative editing to make this look smooth. Okay, I apologize for that camera transition. I had to readjust it and set the white balance to do my best to capture how crisp and clear this display is and how rich the color is. Right now we're set for the 40 meter band as you can see here. We're in lower side band. If I touch that, I can actually change the band or go back. So we want to be in lower side band. And this is the waterfall display. You get a little bit of a spectrum analyzer display up here where you see energy spikes. And then down below there's a nice waterfall display. And each one of these lines represents a conversation or a signal out there. Now down here in the lower left hand corner to the lower right hand corner, this waterfall represents the entire 40 meter band. So at a glance you can see all the traffic that's taken place in a single band without having to spin the big VFO knob to search for a signal. You can see what's out there at a glance looking at the scope. You can also press the menu button which is off camera and bring up audio and it'll actually give you the waterfall, the spectrum analyzer, an audio spectrum here and an oscilloscope over here. I mean, there's a lot of features in this radio. It's a really cool radio. But we're gonna go back to the scope alone, and there we have our waterfall. I'm gonna turn up the volume a little bit and see if we can't find the tapper network. One of the things I'm gonna do is tap the multi button here. I'm gonna push that in and make sure my power level's correct. So I have 100% power, mic gain's 50%, compression's five, monitor's at 50%, so that's good. We'll get out of the way there and we'll go ahead and start looking for a signal. Specifically, I'm looking for the tapper net. Now they're just getting set up, but the net opener will be in about four minutes. Okay. I found the tapper net here at 7.238 megahertz. That's Ruth. She's the net control down in Georgia. And here you can see the tuning bar here. And we'll try bringing up the scope. And we'll go back to the waterfall alone. Now what I'm going to do is turn the volume down here. I'm going to go a little bit off frequency and tune the antenna. So I'm going to find a spot here where there's nobody there and back out to zoom here on the camera. And over here, if you can see my finger, is a button for tune. I'm going to press and hold. And that just tuned the antenna. So we'll go ahead and zoom back in on the waterfall. And hopefully that stays as sharp as it looks here on the display. We'll go ahead and bring the volume back up and tune back on frequency there. And there we have the tapper net. So we'll wait a moment and we'll record the preamble and wrap up this video. Go ahead and get started with the tapper net. CQ, CQ, CQ. This is 
Charlie 4, Bravo Zulu, calling the Catherine Net. Uh, phonetically, that is Tango, Alpha, Papa, Romeo, 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 Romeo